talking to you. Hey guys, Joe here again from Brew Games, and uh, back with another vlog here. And uh, the other day we tried the Scottish Ale from Granville Island. And I mentioned in that vlog that I had another Scottish Ale that I wanted to try. And this one is from Dandy. So this one is the Taylor Retailered. Strong Scotch Ale. It's at 8%, 650 mil. Uh, so the bottle says, bottle conditioned beer, the living yeast in our unfiltered beer will continue to work from the moment it is pitched until it passes your lips. Bottle conditioned beers have unique carbonation and a thin yeast layer. Pour slowly and continuously for the best tasting, best looking pint. So, uh, well, without further ado, let's uh, bust this guy open and see how it is. So as I mentioned in the last vlog, uh, Dandy's out of Calgary. They're uh, an up-and-coming brewery. They've been around for about a year now, I think. Year, year and a half, maybe. Um, as far as I know, maybe a little bit longer, but pretty sure they're not too, too old. And in fact, I believe they're doing a tap takeover at Craft Cellars. Which I'll be going to on March 11th, I believe it is. So, uh, and also on the other side here, it's got a couple more things about it. Taylor Retail at Scotch Ale. A dandy is a clothes-wearing man, a man whose trade, office, and existence consists in the wearing of clothes. The Scotch Ale retailered, much like the dandiest of clothing, this ale honors its roots, yet brings a modern excitement to the drinker. Malty, sweet, and strong, it will stand up to the crisp briskness of autumn days and nights. So, uh, obviously we're not in autumn anymore, but we're in February. Similar weather, especially lately in Calgary. Um, very, very dark. Very dark brown. Uh, much darker than the uh, old school we had the other day. Get that nice, clean Scottish ale smell off the nose. Let's give it a taste. That is amazing. That is super delicious. Um, I'm a big fan of the Pike Kilt Lifter Scottish Ale from Seattle. Um, but this one, man, this one is a contender for me, maybe not buying Pike anymore, my Scotch Ale. Nice maltiness, good sweetness. Um, it's actually kind of refreshing in a way. It doesn't beat on you like a, a Scottish Ale usually does. At 8%, I would not guess this to be 8%. Um, very easy to drink, very refreshing, good mouthfeel. Uh, yeah. Um, so far, I mean, every single dandy I've had has been pretty fantastic. And if this is the route they're taking, um, they need to continue taking this route because dandy is going to be a name that's going to be far spread known, I think, pretty soon. Um, fantastic. Yeah, established 2014, so coming up two years old. Scotch Ale, fantastic. Highly recommend it. I would give this a four, maybe even a four and a half out of five. I really, really like this. Yeah, that is delicious. So yeah, that's the dandy. I'm Joe Evans with Brew Games. Till next time. Cheers.